What I'm doing this week might change everything about how I resell things online. WBK here with a midweek update on how I'm making some money. Uh, maybe you want to learn from this or maybe you just like following along my resale journey. Happy to have you here. Big news, big news. So I just got approved to be on Whatnot as a seller and I'll be doing my first auctions next week. I'll link below to sign up. Follow me. Follow me. Everything is going to be a dollar. 30 second auctions. Maybe you get some steals. I want your feedback though. What should I sell? I'm thinking sports cards. I'm thinking video games. But what I also think might be fun is some more collectible stuff. Some rare DVDs, science fiction DVDs, a paperback, some jewelry anything like that. I would love to just be able to buy these things in bulk because what I love doing is finding out these great deals. And if I can pass that savings on to you, well, I'm going to do it. The second thing I'm doing is also auction related. And I really, really am concerned that it might, <laughs> might be bad because I have not seen anyone do this and I haven't done this in a long time. I did something similar to this about a decade ago. If you can believe that on eBay, or I auctioned off jewelry. And that's what I'm doing now is auctioning off 400 listings. Yikes, 400 listings. I converted from a uh, fixed price to auction from Saturday until today, Tuesday. Can you believe that? Yikes. Yikes. 400 auctions with best offer on there. Now I'm not doing all those auctions at 99 cents. A lot of the sports card singles are starting at a penny or 99 cents plus shipping. Um, and then shipping will be combined, obviously. But most of them, I'm going off of like a third or a fifth of my um, buy it now price. I'm buying all of this stuff personally from thrift stores or estate sale buyouts. So I have pennies or a few dollars into this stuff. So I'm still making a profit. But previously, my business model was go for 10x, go for 15x, go for 25 or 100x in some cases profit. And that does work and it's awesome for like social media, but what's happening now is my warehouse, 2000 square feet is pretty full. Pretty full of just bulk buyouts and pallets and everything. And if I want to make more fresh content and keep my business going and not just turn into somebody who just sits around and lets his cache of things, you know, sell, uh, while still finding ways to list more items to keep eBay happy. It just, that, that equation doesn't add up. So I'm experimenting with auctions to remove my mid tier inventory. Uh, I think I'm going to have to figure out a way to get rid of all my common sports cards because right now, unless I do variation listings, Listing them all individually is just taking too much time and it is making a little bit of money, but it's taking up eBay space and warehouse space, which is really like, I did not foresee that I did the math on the money. The money's fine, but the space, uh, and by extension, like my mental ability to focus on 10 things at once. That's what's being diminished. What do you think? Are you following along? Are you reselling? Are you liking this stuff? Just a quick update video where I'm at. Want to share that with you. Get the community building going on. Talk to you guys. Hopefully engage with you uh, on a more personal basis. I want to hear what you have to say. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later.